Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can apply for the Sajakata Scholarships at the University of Bath, United Kingdom for the 2022 and 2023 academic session. If you are new here, I would like you to click on the subscription button below and tap on the notification bell icon so that you get um, notifications from you to whenever I post a new video. So if, you've, if you have an intention to continue on study in the United Kingdom, this is an opportunity for you. The application for the Sajakata Scholarships is presently uh, open at the University of Bath, United Kingdom. This particular program is available for master's degree uh, applicants. So you can see this is applicable for master's degree applicants in any discipline or choosing field of endeavor. All right, so now you can see that um, the University of Bath is a public research university in the United Kingdom, located in Bath, uh, somewhere else. So they always offer this opportunity to willing uh, persons annually to enroll and be admitted into their scholarship offer. All right, so you can see the link for the application uh, uh, for this scholarship in the description of this video. Uh, so when you click on the link, you'll be able to access this um, interface or page where I am now. So you get a whole lot of other information about this scholarship and all that. So the, the worth of this scholarship is um, a grant of over 3,000 great, great British pounds. The implication of this is that winners will receive this uh, monetary uh, reward for this uh, scholarship. All right, so uh, to be eligible for the Sajakata scholarships, uh, there are a few criteria that you have to meet in order to consider yourself an eligible applicant. First of all, if you are a graduate of uh, a Hong Kong university, it then means that you are eligible to apply. Also, those in, uh, that studied at the University of uh, Chinese University of Hong Kong or the Hong Kong Baptist University are also uh, expected to be part of this. All right, so in order to apply for this scholarship, you have to um, click on the application link below. You can see this is the application link uh, via the official website of this um, institution. All right, so... Uh, the application deadline is still open. It varies. So there hasn't been any fixed date yet for ending this um, application. All right, so let's head over to um, the ap application portal from this um, place. Okay, so once I've clicked on that link, it will bring me to this um, page where you see my work. Okay, so you can see. You can see a few information about this scholarship opportunity. All right, so here you have the courses, research, enterprise departments about. Then up here you have staff, students, new students. So let's open these new students. All right, so uh, that's what we're interested in now. So you can find a, a handful of um, information. You can see information for new undergraduate students. So if you are desirous of studying in any of these um, departments under this institution. You can see architecture and civil engineering, biology, biochemistry, and medical sciences, chemical engineering, chemistry, computer science, economics, education, health, electronics, international management, and modern languages. Then you have um, mechanical engineering, natural sciences, pharmacy and pharmacology, politics, language and international studies, psychology, social and policy, sciences all right so uh if you also are a prospective postgraduate student you can take advantage of this opportunity also 
So there are a handful of um, courses here. All right, so remember, these are all under new student option on their uh, website. Okay, so if you wish to study any of these um, courses or to know more, you can click on them. Like I clicked on that computer science department. All right, so you can see a handful of uh, information concerning this. All right, so thank you so much. That's it on today's video. Hope you got value. If you have questions concerning this scholarship, I would like you to type it in the comment section below. And also, give this video a thumbs up so that YouTube can recommend this video to more persons. Thank you so much for watching. We are glad you did. See you in the next video.
Thank you.